There he is. That's her. Oh yes, it's a call. Good call, dude. Look at that. That's a good call. Yeah. Oh, it's a huge bass. I mean, a monster. Net in the water. Oh, yes. Sorry. Well, welcome back, gang. It does make a difference that you guys come and look at my little channel's videos. It means a lot to me. I spend a little bit of time in front of that screen doing this, and. Yeah, that's a real old computer. That's like a 2010. Got last got updated in 2015. So you don't have to have a real fancy setup to to produce the videos. Now the nicer computer would do more videos and better software and that kind of stuff. So I can't say I'm using the latest and the greatest in technology, but it's not that important. I wouldn't know what to do with half the stuff anyway. So. I'm still doing it with iMovie. I know a lot of people are like, oh my God, that's pretty antiquated. Yes. Hey, there's some guys with YouTube channels that do it all with phones. So at least I'm using, you know, the action cameras. The phone just wouldn't work in the setting where you've got. Hey, before I go any farther, today's video is sponsored by Anglersport Marine. They have an incredible dealer incentive program. Take, for example, today's event. It's the Joe Bass Team Trail. The Joe Bass Team Trail is actually on the Phoenix First Flight Programs list. So if you're wearing the right gear and running the right model and engine, you can win up to a $7,000 purse. Now, now that's on top of what you've already going to win from the tournament. It's a pretty neat program. Let's imagine you bought that, you bought that boat at Angler's Port Marine. They're gonna put an additional five grand on top of that. So if you hear me breathing a little heavier or getting a little more excited, you're gonna know why. There's an additional $12,000 on top of the purse. Well, the purse is determined by how many people enter it and that kind of stuff, but on a Joe Bass on a trim event, it'll be between four and $5,000. So, you know, realistically, we're fishing between 16 and 17,000 dollars uh, for a one-day event. If that doesn't ratchet it up, nothing's gonna. Sure gets my old ticker pound, and I think y'all can tell that. I get a little more excited, too. Maybe sometimes I don't even think clear. Hey, I want to point something out that happens in the end of this video, and you can't hear it because the audio is so loud um, from the wind, is that Gary, I'm ready to go in. We got 20, 15 minutes left in the event, and we've been pounded, running to one end of the lake to the other, getting wet. We've caught a lot of fish, and I'm ready to go in. And Gary says, no, go find us a place and let's fish all the way to the lot, to the wire. I agree, let's do that. And I, so I find us a place, and I don't call him the fish whisperer for, you know, for no reason, because this guy foresaw something, and. That's why Gary Schartz your fishes with me, because he's the fish whisperer, and well, he set my head straight, got me running straight, and I picked the spot, and look what happens in the last few minutes. You're gonna enjoy it. Hey, if you like this kind of thing, smash the like button, subscribe, share, comment, like, all those good things that help the video get driven. So it'll help keep this channel free, and that is truly my whole goal. So here we go.
Oh my gosh. Look at that. Good one. This is David. Where's his? Hey, Mark, you got some hail damage on your truck. Here soon. I'll just get touch and base with you, let you know that we're at right now at least. So, uh, where was the truck when it got it? Much is everything.
didn't have the jig very good at all. Did you get a race jack? Well, I thought I, I was a little, little mushy. Well, that's a good angle. I'm just going to pivot around this tree real slowly. There he is. That's her. Oh God. It's a big one. Here it comes here. Maybe three. What's that? Sorry, hang on. Drop it in there. Uh, such is life. That was a three pounder there. You know, that one I just picked up and it was mushy. I never actually fell and bite it. Like you got one. Might be a keeper.
red. First one that goes red. It's a drum. drum. That may have been what I saw. <laughs> What's a dog thing? <laughs> it was like, oh, uh oh. <laughs> Casper Goo, quit it. Oh gosh, no, it's a keeper, but it isn't a big one. It's a little one. <laughs> Ooh, dismay just hit them. They just hit them. Dismay just hit them hard. <laughs> when they looked over here and saw it, they both That ain't keeper, is it? I don't think so. It's close. I don't think so. So you get it really good.
don't know what that was. This felt good. He measured, doesn't he? Oh, yeah. Put tag on him. He's uh, he's maybe just a hair bigger than the red one. Well, the nature's really making it hard. One of those tags is broken. Lock it right here and come back there and there it is. Looks like five. Yeah, we got five. Okay. We'll worry about calling when we get there. Which right here. Oh for sure. That was out just a hair right behind the boat. Actually, think he came out when he hit the bottom of the net. That's a pretty fish, kid. Yeah, that's a pretty fish. Not a giant. Not a giant. It's not Godzilla, but it's. It's red. It's red. Yeah, it's. It's red going out of there. Look at that. That's a good call. I gotta get a jig. Uh, where did I put them last night? What's that? You have pumpkin sinker. Uh huh. Well, they're green pumpkin violet, which is very sim, very similar. spot box so we shouldn't let it. Just mushy? Or did you feel a tick? Yeah, you know. That's a for sure thing going on. Be back in the game here in just a second. Full on new jig. Deflected and then the bait was gone. 
but I don't think that spot will be fishable today. We're gonna, uh, we're gonna we'll look. Score, that's for sure. I'm gonna take it down. I hope it's not a foolish. I wonder. This feels like there's a lot of north point. I wonder what it's like down by the bridge. I, I don't think it's gonna be bad because I think it's if you got that right west north. twist to it. Yeah, there's more west than north. I think. That's what I'm. That's what we're hoping for. That is what that's a big lay down right here, by the way. See it? Yeah. Talk to me. Might be a keeper, but it's too little. <laughs> right up there by that lay down. <laughs> there. Inches of water over there. Fish, big one. I thought it was much bigger than that. Came off in the air. Yeah. Got to do something, Lonnie. Huh? Will he do something? Uh, close. Just slapped. Really? First good crankbait bite I've had today. Oh, I don't know. He ain't very big. Let's see. We'll do this real quick. Put a little water in this other side. We'll just beam them real quick. That'll give us an idea. Is that the way you just caught? Uh huh. Nice solid fish. Yeah. Average crewman deal. So. Boy, they're just so here at Truman. They're looking to jump out. I just want to stand right here and uh, do it, do the deal. This purple one right here. One. No, it doesn't. Yes, it does. Okay. So. But I'm not sure he's the smallest. That last one there's the, he's, he's way bigger. He's a bigger one, but I'm gonna put a tag on him right now. Weigh that one. Weigh this one? Yeah. I, I don't even know where the scale is. Okay. But he's got a little, starting to show a little rash. Yeah, that was a, a quarter pounder. Oh, for sure. I want to see if I can get him. Yes. It's not a giant. I'm gonna think it's this guy. Oh, he just come off. He just come off the tag. It's either between. Them. I think it's green. It's this guy right here. I thought he. I had the wrong tag in my hand. I think it's him, but. Right.
Oh, hell yeah. He's, He's going to do something. Look how healthy that fish is. I don't know if it will or not, but we're gonna we're gonna try. It's pretty it's pretty big. I think it will too. But I'm betting. So Lake's got some fish in her right now. She's a what she red We know this. This one is for sure gone. Gone. So that gives us our five. There's right. two, three, four, five. Gosh, he's got a better sack than we think. But we just keep going. Right? We just keep going. Because this don't have a big. This right, but these bank has big. Yeah. I know it does. And they're biting. So now we found a second area that they're officially, really, authentically biting. Right? Yeah. Yes. There's no way it's a bass. Get the net. Oh, it's a huge bass. I mean, a monster. Net in the water. Oh my God. Oh my God. In the last minute. I mean, we literally got to go. And I cannot believe that, dude. Oh, yes. You got to call the right one while I'm taking us out of here. Check us out on Fish 30 on YouTube channel. We film it all. Oh my God, Gary. Oh my God. You called it. You said, maybe we'll just come around and get a five pounder. Do you want to drive the trolling motor? Let me do it. Yeah, that's fine. Come, come, come. Uh... Put the big one on the right. Okay. I'll just add water to it. We'll just go nice and slow here. Try not to run over anything. You know, it just kind of was a little shaky and I just decided to ease into it. He had it pretty good, didn't he? We just... Yes. Oh my God, Gary. Yellow it is. It's a pretty good one. Yeah. All right. Let's go.
take him in on this side. Take me in on this right hand side. Thank you. Reverse. 79. How much you got? Big whopping 14 and a half pounds. We got ya. Not by much, but a little bit. We will get a bag. Yeah, I'll go get a bag. What's that? I have no idea. Jody Duncan and John Batusik. Got you a nice new bag. Mr. Well, thank you, thank you. Five forty nine came in while I was standing there, so how good. That's a pretty good one right there. I'm telling you, we got 17, 18 pounds. I don't know if it's quite that much, but... We did not have a tank in the box. Catch a six pounder in the last cast. Come on, it's your day. Dave, there's two of them carrying in. Dude, I'm telling you, well, look right here. We got us a sack right here. We've had these five. Excuse me. Thanks for Patrick and Jeff Hamilton. Ralph. 1282, total weight. 79. Yep. There's one in there that's right. There's one in there that's right. Caught it with two minutes left. Wow. David McCormick and Gary Schartzer went in next. It's sponsored by Angler's Port Marine and <laughs> Phoenix Boats. Be proud of this one. He's going to get him a picture of it. Well, I don't know. Will it break so, six? Nope. Boy. Right at it, 580, 580 on the big. That is second big though. What's leading, weight-wise? Uh, 1843. Ooh, 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 ooh. It's gonna be close, it'll be 17 something. 17? I don't know what you say there. 17? 18? 17? I'm not, I've been 17. 1759, total weight, 1759, David. Good job, brother. Yeah. Tyler Egan and James Egan, sponsored by Enigma, Cruiser right, Tackles, Peter so and Yamaha. The first cast of James They've got a five-fish limit. Chick. All right, I won. First three fish are all. Four fifty-five on the big. Four fifty-five. Uh, Carl's got him. Carl's got a bag. I think he's got us. Yeah, this is not gonna be easy. Big stack of cash gonna go blowing. We want that. Where were we at? Fourth. Thank you. Good job, buddy.
Wow, well that wraps up the Joe Bass team trail at Truman Lake. Gary Schertzer and myself, well, we came that close. Is what it is. I'm feeling blessed. You can't catch a fish at the very end of the day like that and not feel blessed. I feel blessed that Gary put my head in the right place, telling me to have faith and have a positive mental attitude and let's just fish the last 10 minutes when I wanted to go in. <clears throat> well, y'all saw what happened. Blessed. Blessed in more ways than one. To have the good friends that I have that fish with me too. So. Hats off to Gary for having that positive attitude, being the guy he is. We call him the fish whisperer for a reason. Hey, if this is your kind of thing, smash the like button, consider subscribing. Till next time, thanks for watching. Morning. 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 Big man. What's up, That's mine? Yep, that's, that's you. yours. Thank you. All right. 31, and that'll 20, be... 20, so you'll yeah. be second flight. Oh, okay. Huge trade.